Hey guys, this is Jazz here with another quick tips video focusing on the support weapon, the E-Locator. So the E-Locator is a special support grenade that generates a pulse and a radius after opening up. Once an enemy player moves within the radius, they become marked on your screen and a point value of 50 is added to your score. In this black sight clip here, I'm able to cut off two enemies from flanking on the catwalk side of this building and chase at least one down for a kill. This is just one example of how useful they can be for a map control. Uh, E-Locators function just as they did in MGR2, where they allowed you to mark enemies out of sight and give you and your teammates a heads up on where to focus on the map. E-Locators are especially great in this game paired with the Support Plus skill, which increases the amount of support items. In this case, E-Locator ammo is up to 5. Support items include frag grenades, sleep grenades, E-Locators, plus traps, golden traps, and more. In some of these clips here, I use them to find opening kills at the beginning of the match or throw them into parts of the map where I think there's a high concentration of enemy presence. Generally, you want to toss up to two or three to cover a portion of the map and save the last one or two to help you watch your flank. Something notable is that when E-Locators pop midair, they are still capable of pulsing and marking enemies. So if an enemy happens to be in a hard to reach spot, toss an E-Locator up so that it pulses midair near them for a quick mark. Even if uh, your locator doesn't find a target, this gives you an idea of where you can play on the map without worrying about an infiltrator or scout swooping in on you for a CQC KO. Just as I mentioned in my last video, support items such as the plush trap and e-locator give the player and his team a significant amount of control on the map. Despite how quick paced the game can be in certain matches, map awareness can really save your hide with the help of these grenades. So that's it for the e-locator vid here. Hope you liked it. I'll probably be putting out more videos for MGO3 soon enough, so thanks for watching.